Okay, Rory Best has announced that he'll re- be retiring from all forms of rugby as soon as the World Cup is over and therefore he'll be playing his last club game at the end of this season for Ulster. He's been playing for Ireland uh, for 14 years. He debuted in 2005. He has 116 caps so far. Obviously, he'll get more during the World Cup. Uh, and he's 36 now. So, you know, he is at the end of his career. And obviously, he wants to retire on his terms rather than injury taking him out. He's currently sidelined with a, a minor ankle injury that he sustained at the end of last month against uh, Leinster. Um, so that would have weighed on his mind as well that any more injuries would, would take longer for him to recover from maybe career ending so I think that's that's part of the reasoning behind it it was already known it's a sort of a commonly known secret that he was going to retire from international rugby at the end of the World Cup and that he wasn't going to continue into next year's Six Nations but the club rugby announcement um, is a little surprising although not unexpected so let's have a look at what's been said so far uh Ireland and also Captain Rory Best will retire after this year's World Cup in Japan. Uh, it says he's made his debut in 2005, 116 caps for Ireland. And he says this, uh, it's with mixed feelings that I announced my retirement from Ulster Rugby as of the end of the season. This feels like the right time for me to go out on my own terms, a luxury for which I feel very privileged. So, it's, it's the fact that he's got to nearly 37 the fact that he's had an international career of of over 14 years, the fact that, you know, he's had a career that long uh, speaks volumes of who Rory Best is as a player. A lot of players have to retire a lot earlier than that for a variety of reasons, injury normally. Um, he's really been uh, a warrior for not just European rugby, Irish rugby, but world rugby. He's one of the, the, the greatest Turkus of all time. Uh, he's he's a very decorated player, uh, winning you know multiple Six Nations titles. Uh, you know he's been capped by the Lions. It is going to be different without him in that front row for Ireland. He has become a bit of a fixture, um, but at the same time, all good things have to come to an end. Uh, and obviously, more will follow. They will give a further announcements on on various bits and pieces. He is currently sidelined with a minor ankle injury he picked up at the end of last month playing against Leinster for Ulster. And that would have weighed on his mind as well that any further injury that he may may get could be career over um, before he would want to retire. The fact that he said, I'm, do- I'm doing it, end of club season, I'm done, end of the World Cup, I'm done. He's he's come out now rather than close to the time. Yeah, I think he's it, it's it's a fitting way to go at the end of the World Cup. And if Ireland were to win the tournament, that would be the ultimate way for him to retire. Uh, but at the same time, he's he's been to so many tournaments. He's been to the World Cup in 2007, 2011, 20, this would be his fourth World Cup. So not many players get to play at four World Cups as well. So it's a fitting way for him to go out is after the end of the tournament. And there we go. But there we go. That's all we know for now is that he's decided to announce his club retirement as well as his international retirement. Uh, we'll have more details about you know um, his last games, things like that, uh, and what he'll do after he retires from playing. Will he get into coaching? Will he go into a media role? Uh, will he retire from rugby altogether? That's something that we'll find out in due course. But for now, thank you very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. Place your comments below. I'll have some more videos for you soon.